This is a demonstration of a Tektronix CMD80. Uh, they refer to it as a digital radio communication tester. Uh, what it essentially is, it's a cell phone tester. And one of the nice things about this unit is it will work with the older uh, analog cell phones that were around in the uh, 70s, 80s, and probably through the early 90s and I'll do a, a demonstration of how it works with one of those phones uh, in a few seconds. So I uh, just want to first show you the um, layout of this unit. It's got a nice large LCD screen. Uh, it's all menu driven. You can see there's menu items here on the left hand side and to the left of the menu items are push buttons. Same thing on the right hand side so for instance if you want to change a menu item uh, we'll look at this bottom one the system uh, if we want to switch to CDMA well, all you do is just push the button and it switches over if we want to switch back to analog push it again and it switches back um, there's also a uh, keypad and encoder dial and uh, some of the parameters will let you uh, change them uh, either directly by entry on the keypad or through um, uh, turning the encoder dial. So what I'd like to show you now is how this system could actually work with, um, with one of the older cell phones. So let me bring the, the cell phone up. Um, what I have here is an older, really old, Motorola uh, transportable phone. This is a pretty, pretty large unit, um, and uh, it's quite heavy. It has a um, fairly heavy battery in it as well. Um, this is the uh, what they call the Tough Talker transportable. Um, Essentially what it is, it's a um, uh, car phone unit that's made into a transportable configuration. And um, this was back in the day when you actually had, uh, you could have a car phone installed in your automobile. And uh, in a lot of ways it was superior to what we have now because the, um, the uh, phone was... Uh, had a lot more power and uh, uh, I think they worked a lot better in some regard but I want to go ahead and turn the phone on and those of you that remember these phones probably recognize that uh, sound that it makes when it comes on so this is about all you can do with phones these days these old vintage phones is turn them on and you can see there's a red light I'm going to turn my light on here for a second and see if that helps. Yeah, there we go. So you can see that red light is uh, saying no service. That's um, basically all you can do these days because uh, in 2008 when the um, FCC had the uh, cell service, uh, cell phone company shut down the uh, service with um, uh, analog cell phones, uh, there's no longer any cell towers that you can uh, link the phone up to. So what I want to do is go ahead and put the uh, test set into the analog test mode. So I'll go with manual test. And if you look at the phone, um, you can see now that the green light came on and it switched over to the... Um, roaming mode. So as far as the phone's concerned, it thinks that there's a cell tower that it can communicate with. So I'm going to turn the light off here for a second to stop the glare. So the um, looking back at the screen for the test set, um, one of the uh, options that I want to show is how you can actually call the cell phone from the test unit. So you can see the two bottom options uh, 
Second from the bottom is the voice loop back, and then the bottom one is for MS test. So that's the one I want to do. So I'm going to go ahead and push that button. And let's look back at the cell phone again. Oh, you can hear the phone is now ringing. So I'm going to go ahead and answer the call by pushing the send button. And you can see now that the um, far left hand um, LED is lit up, which means uh, that a call is in progress. Uh, one of the things this tester can do is it has a uh, um, transmitter and receiver quality test. So let's go ahead and choose the receiver quality. And if we choose the audio response, it'll actually send tones to the phone. And you can actually hear the tones coming through. Now when it's in speaker mode, it uh, for some reason can't hear the, the quieter tones, so I'm going to take the phone off hook and uh, see if we can hear it. So hopefully that's coming through the audio, but uh, I'll go ahead and uh, uh, hang the phone up now and the in-use light went out Rome light is still lit up so we're still set another thing that this uh, tester allows us to do is we can actually uh, place a call from the phone to uh, to the test unit so I'm going to uh, place a call I'm just going to call the old uh, number for, for we used to have for time, so seven six seven eight nine zero zero, and push send. And if we look at the screen, we can see that um, it's um, connected with the phone, and you can actually see at the bottom there dialed number is the number entered 767-8900 you can see the carrier frequency is uh, 834.36 megahertz I have a frequency counter so let's go take a look at that and uh, you can see that it's at 834.359 megahertz and also um, I have a spectrum analyzer and that's set to go from about 10 megahertz to 1 gigahertz and you can see here towards the top end of the uh, frequency range you can see the signal there at approximately 800 megahertz so um, I'm going to go ahead and disconnect the call and you should see the signal um, go away on the spectrum analyzer and there it is. So um, I'm going to take and put the cell phone down. So this um, this unit is really nice for anybody that has uh, an old cell phone and they want to be able to show their friends what it's like when it actually would be uh, ringing when you'd make a call or have a call received or when you place a call. Um, these uh, older vintage cell phones have become fairly popular and uh, the, um, a lot of people like to either trade or sell them um, and if you uh, uh, look on eBay you can see a lot of times uh, they go for quite a bit of money so having the ability to demonstrate your cell phone is actually working is really nice and this Tektronix CMD80 is a perfect unit for doing that. So um, I hope you enjoyed watching this video and look for uh, other videos for me in the future for other interesting items uh, like this test unit.